Hey, check this out. We are already attacking a Xenon station. So what's that all about? Well, I basically made my way back from destroying that pirate base. Just wanted to take a look into the Xenon sector and there was a lot of valuable loot here. So I'm ready to grab that and uh, to secure my looting ships that no Xenon patrol can flank them and take them out. I'm going to attack the Xenon station and keep them busy. Already have routed a large transport to pick most of that good stuff up. And we should have another trader who just sold some energy cells to that Teladi outpost and I'm going to tell him to collect I especially want those quantum tubes here because that is like the rarest chip component I have right now and now we're going all in on those xenon fighters Want to make sure that nobody escapes and comes a danger for my freighter. My small fleet has already seen its fair share of battles and once this is done I'm going to give them a little rest. Just let them re repair and uh, also don't need them right now because we can't take the major factions head on just yet. I got a message that a new sector is now without an owner, so that would be a good possibility. The Teladi attacked and then stopped their invasion just before destroying the last Boron station. So we have a new potential target to set our bases up. That could be worth our while. Yeah, tactically it was not the best choice to go after these stragglers because uh, the Xenon had a perfect target and could shoot my fleet in the rear. But we should still have the upper hand.
The Xenons still have a couple of Corvettes docked. I don't know why they are not joining, but uh, I'm also not complaining. All right, so here's our trader. He's going to pick those quantum tubes up. Those are the ship crafting component I got the least of. And then we also have a couple of hull plating. That is very valuable for us. Not much ore, but a couple of crystals. That should be a good run. Xenon, Terraformer, LX. These Xenon here are a bit passive. Per and also my fleet is not really picking them up. Don't really know why. Seems a bit bugged. Xenon, Terraformer. But once you attack one of them, he reacts. Xenon, Terraformer, LX. Okay, I think we should be good. Kaiman, super freighter. And he got the quantum tubes. Let's see what else we might be able to get. I'm going to teleport to that freighter. We have hull plating. Let's grab that. Yeah, shields, of course. But I'm mostly here for the hull plating. We could destroy the Xenon station. Yeah, let's actually do that. One enemy less to worry about. So I'm setting my fleet followers to attack the commander's target and select invade. And that makes them attack the station. And I'm mostly focusing on grabbing all that juicy loot before any of the faction salvage crews does. We have taken some losses from all these fights against pirates and now Xenon. But uh, most of these ships, these fighters here, are already old, so they are due for a replacement. Cargo space is already full, these hull plating parts are very bulky. So it's time to get into that super freighter when it arrives. And a bit more cargo space in there.
Ah, it's always a beautiful sight when your fleet destroys these Xenon stations. They still got their patrols though. So we need to be careful and maybe even uh, retreat once the station is dead and just let other factions police forces clean those corvettes up. The Argons are claiming this Teladi sector again. Their battle group only consists of a couple of fighters, so that was not going to work out for them. So here we have the super freighter, let's teleport over. Going to let you return home. Your home base got deleted for some reason, don't know why. Also always use the fly safe command because I think if I just ordered a dock, simple dock at my outpost, you would potentially go through that other Xenon sector and the fly safe command avoids that. Now where's that other hull plating? That's in this area here. My fleet is actually destroying that station really fast. Going to pull them back for now. Don't want these corvettes to undock and then uh, destroy my looter. Right buddies, that is that is sufficient distance. So come to a stop and just wait here. Then I'm going to grab all that stuff, then leave with my freighters, and then we're going to destroy that station. Right, so got a bit of ore left and I want to take these red crystals, also the silicone. So up there is going to be the last bits we are going to grab, the rest is really not that valuable. And then GTFO. The large transport should be on his way. Oh, he's already very far. 
to his way on the first sector I want to place a jump beacon in for future when we are starting our future uh, ex uh, expansion rush and I also gave him a bunch of ships these are going to be uh, wardens for my jump beacons Caustic Xenon are going to try and send small scouts which can infect your jump beacons and actually turn them against you to act as new invasion uh, as new invasion entry points for their patrols so you have to protect them but the protection doesn't need to be very strong it's just a couple of fighters they are going to send I believe if it hasn't been changed by now so we got all the valuable loot and are headed for the east gate so the fleet leader can actually continue invading that sector yes please then we're going to take that station down And once that station is gone, I'm probably telling my fleet just to retreat. I'm not bothering with the corvettes at all, which are undocking when the station blows up. Perseus. All right, so there they are, and we're ordering a flea order for all ships. Some of the more uh, damaged ones are pretty slow, and they're going to get picked off by these corvettes, but uh, I really just want to leave. Don't want to kill these ships here. And most should survive that. Yeah, and these two ships here, that Cayman and that Dolphin here, have a great amount of loot. So that was worth it. We are also one Xenon sector down. Just five are remaining. A successful day, I would say. <laughs> 